The James Street Market has returned to Sault Ste. Marie this weekend. The market opened at James Street Square at 10 a.m. and will run until 6 p.m. today. It was hosted by Algoma Public Health, the Arts Council of Algoma, the City of Sault Ste. Marie, the District of Sault Ste. Marie Social Services Administration Board, Healthy Kids Community Challenge, the Sioux Community Career Center, the Soup Kitchen Community Center, and the Sioux Police Services. On TV was on scene to check out all the action. The ladies here have helped, the ones in, the, in behind me have helped do the pickles and do all the baking. Uh, the food comes from the food farm and it's donated to us. A lot of people have donated us jars and things like that to help us with our, our pickling. And we've done an amazing job teaching people so far um, some of the things that are a lost art, especially pickling, because it's something that we used to do when we were younger with our parents and it's lost art. So this way they can get food in the summer, learn how to process it and have it for the winter. So it's, it's uh, really well done with the food farm donating us the food and then uh, doing the teaching. So it's working out really well. And this is amazing today, the turnout. Well, the importance of this event is trying to give the James Street area a better view to people. It's not a bad area, it's a wonderful area. This area was a market years ago and to see it today, it's amazing been a lot of vendors and I, I think they're hoping to have it more often. This is an idea that's been bouncing around for a couple of years. Uh, it's a concept to get uh, people a medium to sell homemade items and handmade items which maybe there's not a space for. Um, a lot of other cities have large markets, flea markets, etc. and we don't really have anything like that. So the concept's been around for a bit and we, we found uh, with the state of affairs here in Jamestown that this would be the perfect uh, fit for it to bring some life back into this part of the community. And we're seeing lots of faces down here in Jamestown that probably haven't been here for a while and lots of folks looking around and, and probably thinking, geez, I remember what this was like in the 50s and 60s and maybe haven't been here since. And ultimately that's the goal is to get people to come down and, and be a part of the community down here and, and reins, reinvigorate the area. Well, we're actually hoping, uh, judging by today's events, that we can do it weekly next year. Okay. Um, so we're hoping to establish some more permanent facilities uh, so that the vendors can operate out of these spaces on a, either a weekly or bi-weekly basis, whatever the demand is. Instilling that sense of community pride and civic pride in areas that have maybe been neglected for some time. It, it helps people buy into that area of the city and feel like they're a part of the city as a whole and then contribute back to the city in a positive way. We're trying to promote as much involvement with the community as we can with um, like any types of art, which is why we have the community mural open today and we have the free kids painting and stuff. I think we're just trying to show that there is more to arts in the Sioux than just what we previously thought. So I feel like um, events like this are very much about um, bringing awareness to communities that we might not think are here.